Hi, Nicola here from My Inner Creative. We're about to do an entirely new project today. Let's get started. Hi, and welcome to this lockdown edition of My Inner Creative. We are going to do some work today around creating a schedule if you're working from home and if you're working from home with kids. Um, I am doing that and it has been a challenge and I thought you know the best laid plans were ready to go and then it all kind of fell to pieces on the lockdown and have had to retweak it and change it around a little bit so I'm going to show you what I did to try and keep the process going and the best way that I found to schedule in time for learning and work for myself so let's get started the first thing you're going to need to do is put the paper into the laminating pouch. Make sure that it's nice and straight and pop it through once your laminator has heated all the way through. Do that again for the second one and once we have everything laminated we are ready to get started. Now you'll see I have a weekly schedule and a daily schedule. This is totally dependent on what works better for you. I find that using my first weekly schedule just to put or highlight the really important bits is very helpful. I then gather together some sticky notes and some whiteboard markers which are easy to use on the laminated paper because you can just wipe it off. Now, you can see here that I'm using the weekly schedule just to highlight that I have a weekly team meeting every day at 9.30. This is an important team meeting because we discuss what we're trying to achieve for the day and how much we're going to be able to do. On my daily schedule, however, I've put up Mum and Quinn to show which parts of the day are being divided up into task-specific activities. So you can see in my column I have some task specific activities whereas Quinn has a couple too. Then we've got a couple that overlap like exercise, breakfast, lunch, playing and walking and then dinner. Dinner is also a bit more like downtime because we like to watch TV while we're eating dinner at the moment. Everything else gets divided up and I also have extra activities should it be rainy so we can swap out outdoor activities for indoor activities, we can swap out the activities for things that we might need to do during the week and I can kind of transfer these around really easily because they're on sticky notes. I can change them, I can change the times, it is completely flexible and I'm not completely bound by a plan in my notebook at the moment. I also have a list of things to do down the side which I can change on a daily basis or keep a running tab of during the week. Here it is on my fridge. Thank you for following us today and I look forward to sharing with you my next creative idea.